full-time whistle. It's glory, glory, Tottenham Hotspur. In the most amazing Champions League semi-final that most of us have ever seen. Even Harry's ankles looking all right all of a sudden. History made in Amsterdam by Mauricio Pochettino and his players. It's the greatest night in Europe for 35 years since the days of Hoddle and Ardiles, and maybe the best of all time. It's what Champions League dreams are made of. It's a night these players and supporters will never forget. Tottenham Hotspur have come to the Netherlands and reached the promised land. Jermaine Genus, they've done it. They have. Look at those Ajax players. I can only imagine what they're going through. They played so well over the course of the tie. But that second half performance, they gave everything near Tottenham. They had the quality, the belief. They came out a completely different team. They really did. And those three goals from Lucas Moura, like I said, they'll be in the history books of Tottenham forever to come. What a night for the football club. That's nice to see. A touch of class. It was also great to see the applause at full time from the Ajax supporters, who must be absolutely devastated at the moment. But what must those Tottenham Hotspur players be feeling right now? I mean, we mentioned it, Fletch. We said something strange is happening. Something weird is going on. When you go towards that, that last-minute goal that they scored, obviously, that, they, well, that was taken away from Manchester City at the Etihad, he's in tears, look at him. The amount of times that Ajax have hit the post today. Eric Ten Hag cannot believe it, nor can anyone inside this stadium tonight. It's Tottenham Hotspur's night. And I've got a co-commentator alongside me who wore the white shirt of Tottenham with pride for so long. And I've never seen you as emotional as you are right now. <laughs> yeah. We've got two people in tears. We've got Mauricio Pochettino. We've got my mate Jermaine Genus. And we've got Tottenham Hotspur in the Champions League final against Liverpool. And let's not forget that. Hat-trick for Lucas Moura.